Stablecoin volume has hit an all-time high. Coinmetrix has produced this chart showing that stablecoin trading volume has reached almost one trillion dollars. Well, not quite one trillion dollars, but you know, I, I think this is around uh, eight hundred million dollars, which is certainly an all-time high. And it was for August of twenty twenty-two. So the previous high seemed to be May, where it was just above seven hundred and fifty. Then in December twenty twenty-one. And in May of 2021, here's a tweet from the guy Samuel Harrison, and he claimed what well, he says it's almost hit a trillion, so maybe 200 million off a trillion. So crypto is just a fad, right? I think Patrick Long's response is very good. Stablecoin is one of the biggest news cases of crypto blockchains. 24/7, 365 days, banking worldwide, unstoppable, and he's completely right. For as long as stable coins actually represent a true asset. So for example, one BUSD equals one actual real dollar. Then I think stable coins are fantastic. So this article on Thinbold, basically they, they point out how initially stable coins had uh, popularity because they were considered a safe haven, uh, when there was increased volume in the crypto market. So, you know, when Bitcoin was crashing, people would set out and then they would go into stable coins it would need to be TUSD and now we have more uh, reliable options but rightfully anyway so rightfully the article points out that DeFi has uh, brought in some new use cases for the stable coin sector there's definitely some concerns about stable coins after Terra Luna and that's what I'm saying as as long as the stable coins represent an actual asset, so one dollar equals one dollar and not like an algorithmic uh, fantasy, then uh, I don't think there's anything to, can be, to be concerned about. I think it's good that America wants to regulate the stable coin market. I'm sure they have a lot to benefit by promoting the dollar anyway, but hopefully we won't see another terror project. And rightfully pointed out by this article, the Russia have now accepted the uh, stable coins being used for cross border payment. I definitely believe stable coins are a fantastic uh, part of the crypto world and could uh, really drive, uh, really drive mass adoption.